Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying four different kinds of old-fashioned hard candies. These are Clay's candies, and they've been around since 1919. Zach sent us these from South Bend, Indiana. He said that normally they're $1.99, but they were on sale in his store for 99 cents, so he was able to pick up um, these four mm -hmm. for four dollars. I think that's, that's awesome. Uh, I have the wild cherry and the lemon drops, root beer and cinnamon. And we are we are not going to be able to sit here and like suck on a whole candy. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to be disgusting. We're going to put a piece in our mouth and we're going to taste it for a while. Taste it, <laughs> and then we have a, a paper towel that we're going to. Uh, lay it on so that we can go on to the next flavor. But we will be able to tell you what it tastes like to us. Okay, so this is the wild cherry. These are uh, artificially and naturally flavored. They're fat free and gluten free. It says, now you can enjoy that old fashioned wild cherry flavor in some delicious hard candy. Try some today. Uh, I wonder if they're all the same calories. Three for 60. Three for 60. So they're 20 calories each. Uh, they're all they, made the same. They're just flavored everyone. They do have a lot of other flavors. They have natural uh, whorehound. Mm, or, whorehound. Ooh, that's strong. Uh, peppermint, uh, green apple, the watermelon. They have a bunch. Raspberry. Some people love whorehound. Whorehound's been, always been really, really strong for me. Okay, this is the cherry. Oh, and I love this. This It has a, a powdered sugar. Yeah, they're coated in sugar. Mm -hmm. I'll have a picture of them at the end so you can see. They're very, very pretty candies. You could even pour these out into a, mm -hmm. a candy dish. Now, to me, that tastes like a cough drop, but I, but I like it. Minus the medicine mm -hmm. part of it. Yeah, you don't it's a get... really strong cherry. Mm -hmm. You don't get the medicine-y part, but... It's just a good cherry. Mm -hmm. But if you do not like cherry cough drops, I don't think you would like that because that is exactly what it tastes like. It's not like a cherry... Um, lifesaver or anything like that. It's not like a cherry lifesaver. No. It's like a cherry cough drop. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's yeah. Good be good yeah. in a meeting if you're sitting in a meeting and one of the off these candy. Now this is the lemon. Some of those are these really are big. big. Yeah, they, some of these are, are like giant size. Also, you have to get through the sugar coated it before you get the flavor. Mm -hmm. I'll fast forward the part of us going. Boy, <laughs> I hate that sound. Ooh, wow, I just got the lemon. It's really strong. Mmm. That's like eating a lemon. Now see, I like that. I like that quite a bit. Mm -hmm. Is it too lemony to you? Mm -mm. It's not like, you know, like we've said before. A cleaner. Said, like furniture polish or something like mm -hmm. that. That is not like that at all. This, this is more is like a, drinking a lemonade or mm -hmm. something. It's like, yeah, like lemonade. That's a good, yeah. Mm -hmm. I like that a lot. They're quite, quite good. Mm -hmm. That is just like a lemonade. I wonder if you put them, like if you mix them and put them in a candy dish together. If the flavor is good, I don't think so because they're coated with that sugar. I don't. Right. So you could do that. It's so good though. Mmm. This These is are the root beer. Root beer. Love I love What's your favorite, Barks or A&W? Um, I don't know. They're both really good. Mm -hmm. And we drink the Diet, and it's so good. Yeah, Diet Barks tastes better than the Diet <laughs> A&W. But I think I like, and I like Barks. Probably Barks is the best one. But Barks is never on sale, and they don't put it in bottles around here. Yeah, we like to drink it out of the bottle. Yeah, you always buy A and W because that's what's on sale. Mm -hmm. In bottles. Mm-hmm. Aren't they smaller bottles too? They are. This is a 16 ounce bottle. No, the 12 ounce bottle. That root beer is good. Mm -hmm. Good flavor to it. 
Yes, and you can tell that it's not sugar free. <laughs> no. No. You can tell that that's like the full flavor. That's the that's the real deal there. And root beer, um, mm. if you ever get the barrels, after you eat them all for a while, they hurt your mouth. Mm. My mouth starts hurting. These would hurt your mouth too. They're you so think strong. they would? Yeah, they're so strong. Mm. They're very, very good. That is a they're excellent flavor. Mm-hmm. Do you do you like those or the barrels better? I like these better. These taste better quality than mm -hmm. the barrels. I agree. The barrels taste cheaper. I agree. Now this. Now cinnamon. Sometimes I'm not a. Save the best for last. Sometimes I'm not a lover of cinnamon. It counts on a hot they are. I love cinnamon. Love cinnamon. I like uh, red mm -hmm. hots. I like atomic fireballs. Yeah, the fireballs I usually have to take out of my mouth at least once or Yeah, twice. Kevin will hold it in his hand. <laughs> Get too hot. Me. This one's not going to be like that though. Mm-mm. That's just a really nice cinnamon part. Yeah, like a cinnamon disc almost. Mm-hmm. That's exactly what it's like. It's a cinnamon disc. Mm-hmm. Except the cinnamon discs are flatter. Yeah. And this, these have a around the stone. Mm. That's really, really good. Very strong flavor. Um, I'm wondering if I laid it next to the cherry, if I could tell the difference in the color. Yeah, no, it's the same color. red. It looks like the, like the exact same mm -hmm. red that's the cherry. So you wouldn't be able to tell. That That is my favorite. Out mm -hmm. of the four. I like the root beer. Um, I like the cherry. I like the cinnamon. The cinnamon's good. It's just, uh, mm. it's not what I want you all the time. Mm. That's nice. Yeah. I like the cinnamon. The cinnamon's my favorite. And what I will do, uh, I don't know how, how uh, a lot of people do these. I said you could put them in a candy dish. For me, though, I like to put some in a, a baggie, in a Ziploc baggie, and keep it in my purse. Yeah. And like Kevin has put it in Ziploc baggies and put it in his uh, bag for, uh, meetings. for meetings and stuff like yeah. that. Kevin loves taking stuff like this for meetings. I'm sure the person sitting next to me loves it. <laughs> you know what? You have nice breath. I would rather have someone with nice breath. Uh, Making Squishy noises. Yeah, that someone with bad breath, you know? So, yeah. So, and thank you very much, Zach. These are really, really, really good. good. I like them. And now that I've seen that name, Clay's, I'll have to be on the lookout for them around here uh, to see if we have other flavors. Uh, so, I really appreciate you all sending me these. Uh, I mean, you sending me these. Um, I should i have a picture of one that's powdered and one that's unpowdered i don't know if anybody wants to see the slobbery ones okay they're well not, they're, not they're not slobbery they're not slobbery they now. just have the sugar on them <laughs> yeah i'll take a picture uh, and you all will know that these have been sucked on but that's okay um and i'll take some uh with the powder and then some without so that you can see what they look like because they're really pretty i love them with the powder on them i think they're gorgeous so i hope you enjoyed the video if you've had these before or other flavors that you really like leave me a comment below because i i would like to hear about your experiences and thanks for watching